Hello guys, welcome to my channel Be Anonymous. In this video, I am going to explain you all about command prompt. You generally get more videos in YouTube and other sources, but this video will be different from other because after you learning about the command prompt, the end of the video, you will get the two projects. One is how you can watch movie using telnet method. Another one is how you can create matrix. Without wasting any time, let's go into our terminal window. The first step we have to do is click on the start button and write command prompt. This is our command prompt. On clicking the this command prompt, the windows terminal will be appeared in this way. You can see the color of the test is green. Uh, this may be different in your PC because I have changed the colors. Let me maximize my size when you click on this you can see the title is command prompt you can also change the title and this allied book everything of your choice i will be showing from the basics let's click on the uh, bar and click on right click on you can see restore move minimize other options let's get into a, in edit option you can paste or scroll you can select everything default object you can see in this way these are the colors has an earlier set my, my background color is black in default you can change any color depending upon your choice this is the opacity that we wanted and the second most color is second most option is the layout option from this layout whenever uh, when you open the window you see that the terminal is minimized window this is a window that appeared in front of us. You can change the width on the height of your choice using these options and wherever you want it, you can also change it. And the next one is the font. On the font size, which font size you want, you can choose from here and also the same everything like a word file, you can choose every from thing from it. And the next option is the cursor size or the small or medium or large or which size you wanted you can choose it from here and the options they uh, enable it all options uh, which will be easier for to use whenever you're using the command prompt okay guys now uh, when you start the command prompt the first function you have to use is what you have to use first is you you don't know anything about the command prompt the first command you will be using is help um, let me show you what help does this is the help here you can see the various commands that are used in command prompt here you will get everything which is important to you using the command prompt uh, let me type a tree command a tree command what is written the graphical displays the directory structure of a drive or the path so when i type tree you can see yes it has displayed the path then um, the next command you should learn is the clearing the display whatever written in the display it is clumsy so i want to clear it all so i will use the command cls clear it will clear everything this is the basic command and also with the help you can do you can use another command for suppose i need to know about the color i don't know what the colors used so when i type color and use this command here you can see all about colors will be appear in this window zero black blue if i want to change the color to the red so i will be typing color yay you can see uh, not yay it will be green um, for red it is four so four color four you can see yeah Reka. it is changed now clean this window and uh, i want my color back so i will be using the command color yay that's it now you have learned about the colors and uh, also you can use help over here for suppose i use color help so at starting you have to write help me on colors so you, you will get the same thing so you can use either that command or you can use either help uh, it's your choice another command i want to show use 
system file checker if you want to check the files whether it consists of a virus or anything you want to check whether the file is corrupted or it is okay for that i will be using the command as of c the system file checker and scan now when you run the command it says you must be in administrator running okay i should the command room to be in the administrator for that i will be closing this and command prompt right click over here run as an administrator click on yes here you go you have run this in here you can find administrator command prompt here you go you administrator now sfc command scan now here sorry for the error yes it begins you can see beginning beginning the system scan the process will take some time being verification it it will complete you can see and uh, you do not want the time to waste it and uh, you can do it later uh, if you want to stop anything in between so you can simply write the command or you click on it control plus c when you type control plus c it will stop see this stop cls yes um let go into our command prompt it will be more simpler for us you can either use administrator sometimes uh, using the administrator gives uh, more facilities you have now we have learned the basic commands and if you want uh, much more about the uh, command prompt i will be uh, showing in the description you can check in the description where i will be uh, uh, keeping the link where you can get more commands uh, there we can get more than 100 commands but using the help command you can find everything in the help so need to go to any website or check on that and the next thing i will be showing is more important uh changing the directory whatever directory but suppose if i click on this i want to go to the desktop directory then what command i have to use cd cd means the change the directory to the desktop desktop here you go reka you find the directory is changed and if you want to remove the directory desktop simply typing cd this one okay the desktop is gone the directory is removed from here and to make the directory mk d directory you okay? can use many type of uh, there are many commands so you can learning it later uh, now i will be showing the more important commands which will be using for hacking purpose it is a basic of in cyber security and ethical hacking thing the first one is to know the ip address of any website for that i will be using the command ping when i ping any website let's suppose google.com when i ping it i will be getting the ip address of that google.com here you go this is the ip address and these are the packets that are sent very simple let's him and the next command we have to use is ns lookup it will resolve the dns into ip let's say ns lookup double Come on. Uh, I have wrong. I have the wrong one. Here you go. The address, name. It resolves the DNS into IP. The next one is trace. It will display the root path between the. Computer, your computer, to that website. Google dot com. I am getting an error. Be aware of the command because these commands are more important. Here you go. If there tracer, it will trace 
uh, we can say it will display the all the route path between your computer to the website to the google we can say here in place google sometimes the packet may not reach and it will be showing you timeout and um, in this place you will be getting the stars kind of things here it it, uh, it was taking so much of time uh, it may be the packets are not reaching in this time so after some time uh, you will get in time error let us close this control c see you can see stars sometime it is faster let's close this command cls if you want to know the arm details here you will get all the details physical address are these are the interfaces and the next one is if you want to know what your pc's ip address if you want to know what it is connected with and what are the dns gateways and everything that is needed in the purpose you can use the command ip config ip config all that's it you will get everything about the virus land the adapter that gateway the dns ipv4 ip6 every address you want if you want to know if you want to see the connection status at present i was using uh, the redmi phone to connect the wi-fi so let us see what i will get You can use the command. Here you go. It shows uh, some uh, addresses that are connected to me. These are the active connect uh, active connections. Let's close it. These are the simple commands that you can use in your command prompt and make your friends amazing and surprising towards you. Let us say how you can watch movie in the command prompt. Yeah, it's so simple. First, we have to enable the telnet. For enabling the telnet, here we have to open the control panel. For that, in the start button, I will use control panel. Then go into programs. Click on turn Windows features on or off. In when you scroll down, you will get telnet client, and please check it. so that you can use a command in the command prompt you can watch the movie using this command telnet that's it in this way you can watch the movie let's close it in the second one is to create a matrix for that i will have to choose test document i will give it a name matrix sorry spelling no problem here i have to write 
go off. Pause. It should be green color. Thousand, two thousand. Random take number from random a number. I will copy it, paste. That's it at last. Go to matrix. Let's add some more. It's enough, I think so. I have to save this. Save has. Don't forget to save has dot bat. That's it, guys. Close this. You can see here. And I click on it. Let me show in the full screen. Tar, easy. Very cool. If you show to any of your friends, it will be very, very, very interesting and amazing thing. And those who are interested in collecting and uh, any other courses, please subscribe to my channel. That's it. Peace.